Hi there, Ruthuk from PCL Engineering Team. So today we're going to talk about PCL Web Extension, which is a browser extension that works across Chrome, Edge, Opera, Firefox, and Brave. Now, before we dive into that, for those of you who don't know what PCL is, PCL is an AI-enabled productivity tool for developers. PCL provides personalized workflow assistance that works across your entire tool chain, but also proactively captures and enriches useful materials that you come across. Now, PCS can also help you streamline collaboration between you, your friends, and your colleagues, but also help you solve complex problems when you really need it to. Now, where does the PCS Web Extension come in all of this? PCS Web Extension sits right in your browser, can help you streamline workflow within your browser. For example, uh, when you come across any snippets on a site, PCS Web Extension will add these embed buttons around that site that can help you perform certain action. Like uh, when you think about it, when you sail through pieces, you are not only saving the code itself, but also saving the contents around that snippet and also the URL on which the where the snippet was discovered. Now with this information, you can peacefully close all the 50 tabs that you had opened and rest assured that everything that you need around what you captured is saved through pieces. Now to get started with using the pieces web extension, the first thing that you need to do is install pieces OS. Pieces OS is a background service that runs on your device locally and that facilitates communication between our different products. It also manages the different uh, local LM models that we provide, but also provides features such as real-time search and suggestions across our entire products. Now, one of the things is that PCOS runs 100% offline on your device, uh, but also has an option to connect to cloud for things like backup and sharing or using some of our uh, cloud-only models. Now, depending on your OS, you can download it for Windows, Mac OS, or Linux. If you want to read further into it, you could uh, read it at our uh, PCS OS Getting Started docs. Now, once you have it, the PCS OS running, uh, you could install the PCS Web Extension. Uh, right now, I'm on Chrome, so I'm going to install the Chrome extension for PCS. So, as you can see, I already have it installed, but if you are on other browsers like Firefox, Edge, and others, uh, you could download it from their respective uh, extension store. Uh, our documentation for the extension details on the steps that uh, you can take to download the extension for each browser. Once the PCS Web Extension is installed, uh, it will launch this onboarding page where you can familiarize with its different features and functionalities. To give you a demo of it, here's one snippet. When I hover over it, you can see there are certain actions that are shown. If I click on copy and save, what it's going to do is going to capture the code within the snippet and also the context around it, as well as the site it originated from. Uh, these snippets are stored in our uh, pieces of central repository, which can be seen through our uh, pieces desktop app, uh, which uh, along with showing your sales snippet also gives you an overview into the information that was captured and the information that pieces of generated for us, like different annotations, related links, related people, tags around the snippet, and a lot more information that can help you uh, with investigating the snippet. There are other actions that you can take through our desktop app, like editing the snippet, formatting, creating shareable links, uh, which you can explore into further. So other things uh, that uh, piece of web extension enables is uh, creating shareable links to the of the snippet that you found online. Uh, it's a really easy way for you to quickly generate a shareable link that you can share with your friends, but it's just not a shareable link that shares your uh, snippet. What it does is it also captures the uh, context around it and as well as the other information that we saw earlier for our desktop app and also presents that to the uh, any person that is uh, viewing this snippet like uh, related links that we had for that snippet tags and related people for that snippet. So this uh, really uh, reduces the overhead of like uh, annotating stuff manually and sharing with your friends. You can also use web extension to see all of your save snippets. Uh, if I quickly save this snippet right here and go to the save snippets tab, uh, you can see that the snippet uh, is already captured and generated. Uh, the process was almost instant. And if I click on this snippet, we get a view that is similar to the desktop app uh, with your snippet displayed here and the other information that was captured from the snippet as well as the uh, generated by the piece copilot shown here. One of the things that Pieces Web Extension tries to be is to wear AI companion in the browser. You can use it to ask questions around the code that you found online uh, and get answers to those questions right from your browser uh, without much context switching. But to give you an example, if I click on the Ask Copilot button here, it will launch the extension in the sidebar uh, with the code it captured and send it to the copilot uh, to generate some response. Now, if you give it a second, 
you will see that the pieces copilot uh, gave us a really detailed response on the, what the snippet is and what it is trying to do it also added some suggested questions for us to follow up within the conversation that you can uh, ask the copilot now depending on the model that you picked uh, the, your response may vary i currently had gpt 3.5 turbo cloud model from openai but you can also pick from other cloud models like palm 2 gemini as well as local llm models offered by microsoft like phi 2 cpu and gpu models as well as llama code llama and mistral models now one of the great, uh, greatest things about pieces of web extension is is that you don't have to do a lot of context switching where you are trying to use it. It's just right in your browser and right beside the site that you are looking at. You don't have to switch to a completely different site to use it and copy your code or other information, paste it into that site to get your answer. Pieces Web Extension does it for you and it's just a, a single click experience when you want to ask Copilot about a code you found online. So we talked about saving snippets from the browser, creating shareable links and using Ask Copilot uh, through the Pieces Web Extension. Now that's just scratching the surface of what Pieces Web Extension is capable of doing. Once you start using it, you will see that uh, it has a lot of more other features that can help you ease your day-to-day -day workflow within the browser and how you interact with the code online. So we'll be exploring those features and functionalities in our upcoming videos, but until then, uh thanks a lot for tuning in our today's video and uh hopefully i'll see you in our upcoming videos uh see ya